So let me know when you're filming. And I'm not going to talk so much. So you're good. I'm going to talk over it. But he's filming. Okay, good. So you're doing the straight line stuff because this leg comes up and over. Good. This hand will come up underneath here. Okay. And then this position, I'm going to do it three times. This rolls forward. And then you start to let your body come up with it. That's that bottom leg. Then your chest up. And then just low down and resist control down. And do it two more times. And then up. Good. Then one more. Good. And then down. And then you're going to come up. We're going to transition into the, uh, actually show the correction. So if you hold here. So this is where you put your hand if you're going to correct it. So just come on up again. And just give me two more like that. And that way. I'll explain what all this is in my one. You might find it cool because it's DNS stuff. Good. And then now we'll go into here, and then you're going you're gonna to go into the, the side plank. Okay. So the, you just go naturally where your arm wants to go to come up into the plank. Okay, so when you come on up, then plank it, and just watch your line. So make sure you're straight. Watch, keep your head in line, mm -hmm. okay? Like that, okay? And then you can keep up in here, and then we're just going to see if you can hold that for 60 seconds. And then you go down, and then let's compare to the other side. Let's, so let's flip them to the other side. You can keep them and just get a good angle. So do you want to go this way? This is just part of my assessment technique when I look for just basic movement patterns. So, so make sure you're straight first. Scoop that in. Good. Okay. Top leg comes over. Good. Hand comes up underneath. Okay. So then same thing. Down. Up. A little tougher on that side, isn't it? Yeah, this side is. It is tougher. Down. That's what I'm looking for. I'm just looking. Can... They feel a difference. I want to know that too. Come on up. It's not as split. See how he's got a struggle? Mm -hmm. Did you notice that? Mm -hmm. That's very important for us to know in regards to his rotational pattern and for him uh, doing what we need him to do to dissociate. One more time. Mm -hmm. Good. I can just see overall how he's losing stuff. So if I wanted to have <coughs> him correct it, then just put up here and just help yourself just, just to what you need by pulling on your knee to make it smooth. You hit that sticking point. Just give just enough. You feel it? So he's able to self-correct and go what he needs to for the times. And this is where I would keep him until he could own each one. Good. And then from here, let's go down and then you go on. When you come up, put your hand in. Just go into your um, side, plank. side plank. So come up, put your arm where you need to to find it. Just in a plank. Then up. Oof. <laughs> See that? Yeah. So from here, let's do it in a little bit. Watch your neck. You know, keep your neck back. Okay? And then down. So, good. So what I use that for, uh, perfect. 